and welcome back to Zudesia. We are here in the Temperate uh, Forest area with a Bambi, the ever fussy deer, and I'm just going to show off the amazing new perch leaf wall uh, we've made. This is going to be a much nicer naturalistic exhibit for our deer. Even though Bambi has a lot to say about it. Bambi, do you just do you just need to be moved out of this corner? Here. Eh, eh, push the deer butt. Oh, so you weigh freaking like 200 pounds, I swear. Uh, which means we're feeding him well, but honestly. But check this out, guys. This is the new backdrop to the exhibit, and I am totally in love with it. It looks so much nicer than that wall of dirt. I don't know why I didn't think leaves. Leaves are always the answer. But I went and I cut down a few more birch trees and, of course, planted their saplings. And I put some lovely leaves in here. But there's plenty of room for more temperate, uh, little temperate flowers to be scattered around. And actually, you guys were so awesome with names! Bambi, I'm going to bring you back so many ladies. So I did some research, and as I thought, the white-tailed deer actually can be found. It wow, this is a lot of snails. <laughs> Slugs. That's awesome. But white-tailed deer can actually be found in groups, usually matrilineal herds, meaning females and their fawns, um, will stay in groups of often up to hundreds. So that totally justifies getting a few more deer to put in our white-tailed deer exhibit. Um, ooh, and there's some pomegranates that are fresh and ready to harvest over here. So we are going to head over and look for some deer because everybody had so many amazing deer names. And I was like, oh my gosh, I totally didn't expect that. So that's actually going to be what we're going to work on today is getting a bunch of deer for the deer exhibit. And yeah, she's not on. So we're going to pop over to Mara's because she still hasn't gathered up her rewards from our Easter special. She has forgotten about her roaster and she has also forgotten about... Um, like all the cool stuff that's in it so I think we'll take it to her and drop it off for her let's see oh and then the debate I'm trying to figure out where to put the birch wood oh thank you darling oh there he goes he's out to read in the front yard oh, I love it when he just walks by like that but um yeah I'm really excited to go see Mara so I thought maybe we could take her some snacks fruit salad refreshing drinks Let's take her some melon smoothies, uh, because they're delicious. And do I have any cookies? No! But I will share with her some of the cool fruit crumble that somebody made for me. So I got this in the mail, so I'm going to share a few of them with her, because sharing food always makes you feel good. And then let's see, I think I should, like, let's share some of our bounty of asparagus with her. We'll share a couple things of asparagus and uh, some of our parsnips with her because we've definitely had an excellent garden bounty lately. All right. Oh, and I still have the pomegranates. <laughs> I totally forgot about them. I think we will go ahead and juice the pomegranates because pomegranate juice, while a little bit bitter to me, is very yummy. All right, and we'll wash, wash, wash that and put it up. Hello, Artemis, little scratch behind the ears. All right, whew. Oh, and it looks like Darling's almost done with his mushroom stoop, which is a couple days old now, so I should probably clean it up anyway. But let me think. Um, we also enchanted a diamond shovel. It has efficiency three because Mole Fingers is still taking a little while. He's doing better. He's starting to heal up for sure. But I think we just have to carry him around for a long time, and then he'll heal up. So let's see. Yeah, it's going to be an expedition to go and get ourselves some female deer and fawns. And we will stick them in the safari nets. I think I'll take two pup pups with me. And we'll use these safari nets as the ones to recatch them. Hmm, and then I have a whole bunch of like horse. Oh, yes, two more empty safari nets. Thank goodness. Um, a lot of this stuff. Oh, yeah, I need to trade these with Dr. Nami. Hmm. Hmm, Dr. Nami might need more assistance now that he has a bigger lab, too. So I'm going to have to look into that. Goodness, there's just so much. Just so much. Well, let's put Mara's presents in here to start with. I love how busy we are all the time. Oh, look, we have some chest and signs. Good. Oh, it's my command block. Oh, geez. Maybe I'll find my sit, stay, and play stick soon now, too. Can't believe I misplaced that thing yet again. All right, put that there. Got a dog treat of rotten flesh for somebody. Got some random carrots for who knows what reason. Oh, we'll drop those off at the uh, rabbit area, even though we're very low on rabbits out of the blue. Phew. All right, so ah, 
I need to sit, stay, and play stick if we're going to command the dogs. How embarrassing. Well, let's go downstairs. Maybe I stuck it in the carpentry box again. I have a bad habit of sticking the sit, stay, and play sticks in the carpentry box. But no, it's not here. But at least I have a new stick. And I think we'll take... Um, well, we're going... Oh, thank you, darling! Another heart. He is just so generous. I'm going to put that with all the other hearts I have. Um, I think I'm going to take the two flower girls today since we're going flower and let's see we're gonna have you be docile and follow us come on iris you can stand up pine oh and i found i when i was uh digging out more birch leaves from the plant storage shed i found the pine tree so we we're able to put one down for pine so that made me really happy all right tate go wander around there's food in your food bowl if you sit in this corner no wonder you can't find it my beloved pup pup and Lily, what the heck happened to you? <laughs> look at that sad look she just gave me. Lily, what the heck? Come over here. Heal up. There. So she instantly ate and got better. Lily. Lily girl, what happened? Hang on. Let me see if I can I can get your, your tail to go up a little bit. Yeah? No? She's like, I'm not in the mood yet, Mom. Oh, man. Oh, that does remind me, though. We're going to need to take some food for them. And is Tate moving? Tate, Bubby, where'd you go to? He just, like, teleported in front of my eyes. Tate! Oh, Tate, you dug a hole. Tate, come on. Mom has to go, Mom has to go look for some deer because everybody got super excited about naming them. Bubby, what are you doing in the ground? Tate, come. Okay, got him. And he picked up my dirt for me. <laughs> I guess I'm just going to put birch leaves here for now. And let's put Tate over here. There, now he's eaten. And then, all right. Iris, Lily, I'm going to put you two away in just a minute. Come on with me, ladies. And we are going to go to the temperate plant storage shed and drop off the birch leaves and the pieces of birch tree that we have built with. And I love that backdrop. The deer exhibit just looks so much nicer now. So let's drop these off in here. Do, 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 do. And back up. Come on, girls. And we're going to grab Mara's stuff. And we're going to go teleport over to Mara's base and leave her stuff there for her. Um, do I have... Let's see. I better trade with librarians for a written book. I don't know. I think she'll know where it's from and where the extra is from. So I can't believe... And I am going to actually get Karate to come from the Village of Lights guard tower... You! Come here, you! Oh, jeez, there it went. I was like, why did the, the panther not get in? Oops. And I almost walked straight into Naomi's exhibit. But Naomi is not over on the side. So we're going to release this panther far away from our home and see if that helps with uh, the loss of various animals. All right. All right, let's see. Let's come over here. Easter egg contest winner set. This is Mara's. This is Mara's. These are Mara's. These are Mara's. And these are Mara's. And really, the chest is Mara's, too. So we'll pick those up for her. Open up Lily's area. Put this all in. We'll move these, I guess, and we can put everything in her gold chest. Oak leaves, eggs, roses, all very nice. Hey, y'all! Uh, oops, I forgot. Oh, well. I forgot to actually like put the carrots in with the carrot keepers, but I think we'll just trade them to Teddy for some coins. Some spare coins on our way out. Ladies, are you following? There's Iris. Is Lily with us? Hey, Iris, have you seen Lily? Okay, there's one. Huh. Well. Iris, it looks like it's just you and me for this trip, my dear. Uh, oh, yeah, and I still have a panther. Well, we'll release it into the wild. All right, let's put Iris away real quick. What an odd little trip. Hey, Toby. I don't hear the villagers. Oh, but there they are. I get worried whenever I can't hear her, her inside the village. All right, let's come in here. We a little bit, little bit of jitteriness as I get used to the village again. Oh, hey, Rain. I haven't seen you in ages. Teddy. Hi. All right, we've got plenty of carrots for Teddy. So let's trade with her real quick. Thank you, Teddy. And then let's see, is there anything, uh, you know, like any food, delicious food we might take? 
It's a nice carrot soup. Oh, let's take a carrot cake from Mara. I can't resist that. So let's take a carrot cake from Mara. And then we can go to the library. Let's pop by the library real quick. Our beautiful teleportation stone. Any new announcements? Blaze, rods needed, we'll pay. Vegan mother needs to feed some beef. Paleontology 3 pickaxe for sale. I think we might get that paleo 3 pickaxe from Mara. I'm debating on it. Hey, everybody, I'm so glad you guys are all, all readers. Hey, Victor. And now the librarians do trade you for a book and quill. So let's go ahead and get some books and quills. Here. Yeah. All right, there's one, two, three, four, five. And I have... <laughs> Can I leave you like the coin is as a tip, Victor? Thank you so much for your hard work here at the library. And let me wiggle out here. Whoops. Oh, hey, look, it's our, it's our enchanting villager. Hi! Okay. And then actually, let's pop into Teddy's and sleep real quick before we go over to Mara's. And in here, in here. Wiggle our way this way. Oh, it's still Mara's stuff over here too. We'll bring her we'll bring her that stuff as well. So that she's got all of her awesome little treats that are scattered around the world. Let no one say we don't we don't give back. But I don't think she had been here uh since we started like dropping those things off. So let's do this. Alright, and now we are loaded up on returning all of these things to Mara. That's awesome. All right, let's go. And then while we are out visiting her place, we'll wander around just a teensy bit. And Mara land. Da boink. Oh, look how cute it's gotten. Oh, goodness. Look at Mara's little shack. I swear I fall in love with this place every time. It is just so adorably cute. Ah, well, we don't want to be rude. I'm just going to kind of peer in the door. Oh, look, it's Ben and Daisy! Benny Daisy, how are you guys doing? Look, and you can see a little hatch in the ground. Oh, that's so cute. Well, let's go ahead and come over here. And let's get out her golden... Let's put these miniature hearts away for a second. Uh, actually, we can put the stick away. And let's get out her gold chest and put it right here. And start putting all her awesome stuff in it. Because we had so much awesome stuff for her. So she can now not have to go anywhere to collect all of it. Let's see a little bit of glowstone we gave her. Um, gave her these hearts. So let's see. Yeah, we'll just put a couple there. Like there's so much stuff. So um, I guess you can leave her a little gold coin. <laughs> and then let's see. Oh yeah, we brought her this. Let's put all these books and quill away. This is the one I'm writing in. This is one we'll leave a note for her in all that away. I'm going to take a fish net because Mara actually has wild fish in her area that we might be able to catch. All right, put these away. We need this sign. Don't need the command block right now. Uh, these are her oak leaves, eggs, and I'm bringing her some fresh asparagus, fruit crumble, and parsnips. Talk about quite the variety in gifts. That's so awesome. But you know, that's part of the, the huge, tremendous fun of having this world that we all share together is that we just kind of like end up giving each other such random things and it's like honestly part of the fun is figuring out how to lay it out inside of the chest <laughs> let's put the parsnips on the bottom um and then let's put like the asparagus over here just like a line of asparagus i guess here come here asparagus spread you guys there Oh, never mind. It's just making an asparagus mess. <laughs> and then some some chicken eggs and uh, some melon smoothies. Like, we're really just making kind of a mess in here. It's kind of adorable. Oh, and then let's put the roses over there. And the rose red dye. Um, I guess the coin. Like, no, that looks like a little flower on top of the cake. Uh, oh, and the rooster. rooster. Um, hmm. I guess we'll do this. And was there anything else? Oh, yeah, I was going to give her some fruit crumble. And there's no way they're going to be even, so we're just going to awkwardly leave the fruit crumble. Like, actually, I guess we'll take one there. Oh, my, my urge for the symmetry of this area has been filled. So let's put down the sign. Uh, mail for Mara. And returning. Uh, and actually, let's see, catching up. Catching up with gifts, I guess is a good way to put it. All right, and then let's leave her a little book. Hey, Mara! While cleaning up the Easter special area, I noticed that you had, whoops, 
that you had left behind your uh, awards for winning the chicken hatching contest, including an adorable little roaster, uh, roaster that egg. It will hatch into a red chicken that lays red rose dye as it walks around. Be sure to keep it in a safe area with a name name tag to keep it around. They are beautiful and rare and normally only found in garden biomes. Also, most of this is your stuff already. So although I would love to spoil you with more gifts. <laughs> no, that sounds weird. Uh, love to take credit for the chest of awesomeness. Mostly I just collected this on my way to give back to you in your new home. Though I did include some healthy, whoops, healthy greens, asparagus, and parsnips from my garden harvest. Spring is wonderful. Also some, also sharing some delicious fruit crumble a good friend mailed to me. I hope you enjoy. You have a beautiful place here. And then, eh, heart, 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 Siri, sign for you. Sign. Oh, and then we're on <laughs> even again. I guess I'm just gonna keep the one coin. It is kind of like giving your friend a penny, which is sort of weird. So we'll do that, and then I still have the big cat to release, but we can have Iris come out. I know, sweetie. Somehow I forgot to double check that I didn't have Lily like sitting, and now it's just you and me, Iris, but we're gonna go wander off and we're going to see what is in Mara's beautiful land and her beautiful area. Gather up quite a few flowers. She told me I could come over and do a little bit of fishing whenever I needed to. And we're also gonna see if we can find more deer. I think we should try out like maybe that fir forest over there. Hmm. But all right, everybody, I will see you next time when we are going to go on the search for deer and all sorts of other things around Mara's beautiful land. So I'll see you guys then. Bye-bye.